guys and welcome to the Staffordshire Searcher out in the field again today, same one where I found that Charles II Silver Queen it was nice this morning, it's raining now unfortunately but let's see what we can find so here's the field and usual settings on the Vanquish Julie mode discrimination knocked down one here because we've got no power lines until way over there. First find of the day, guys. We can see you right there. Very, very well detailed half penny. 1941. It's got George on the back of it. And go, there's George the sixth. Caught moan at the first one being a coin. It's looking like a good day, guys. So. There's my last plug. Here's my next. And another coin. A penny. George the sixth again. Fifth. 1920 something. Now I'm guessing this one isn't old and it's tiny, but I saw that sticking out. This one coming at a nine, where the others were like 24. Button or coin? Modern, no. Ah, oh, no way, three pence. It's going focus. 1962. Found be Lizzie on the back, but kind of see her. Oh, dropped it. I can't tell it what's on it. What three pence? Here's the next one, guys. This one coming at a 18. I've cleaned it up a bit. Can't really see what's on it. It's a toasted one. Very badly worn, though. You can see some sort of markings on that side, but I cannot make out for the life of me what they are. Another one here, it's a little bit noisy guys, quite close to the road. But I believe it's a Vicky Bonnet. Pretty sure she's there. Kind of see the date on the bottom, probably we'll see that when I clean it up. And here's another one guys, a half penny. 1918. Quite good condition that one. Here's another one. I've not pulled it out yet. Let's say George the second. Another nice button this time. Another lining on it. Old gilded one again. Got another button, guys. I see some sort of picture on it. It's an old one. It's a real old one. Coming at 12. Another button, guys, but I'm over the moon with this one. Uh, massive. I've never found a button like that before. An army button. Only came in at eight. Must be the gold gilding on it. Hey guys, back home and clean the finds. Um, I haven't cl really cleaned it very well. I haven't really done a lot. We've had a poorly boy for the past few days, so it's um, it's been a tiring hard work, as you'll know if you've got kids. But let's show you the finds. I'm quite impressed. I quite I absolutely love that button. Um, trash pile. Our old things, a kickstart. 
Loads of moo tubes. Loads of junk. But they're the good stuff. We've got that gold gildy button with a lion on. And my favourite. Looked it up, it's World War Two. Used to be on the uniform. Possibly World War One. But that condition I imagine World War Two. Then we have this coin. More any focuses. There we go. Dead hard to see it, but I think it is George the Second. He's facing left. Can't see anything on the other side. Naka Penny. He's there on the back. Cannot see the data. Oh. Let's see if that'll focus in on it. It says 1920. There you go. And another penny. This is the bonnet, I believe. Can't see it now, I've cleaned it though. Drew sick. Half penny. There you go, 1918. There's the three pence. Try young lazy on. This, not a clue what it is. Ruined, I can tell you that it's that, but I don't know what coin it is. And a very old one. So after all that, not really a bad day. Lots of rubbish, but not too much of a bad day. If you like this video guys, hit a like, subscribe down the bottom for us. Put a comment for us if you know any of them finds, or you can date any of them. I'm quite intrigued with the uh, buttons, especially these gold gildy ones and where they came from. I have tried to look them up, but there's so many different types. It's hard to find where exactly they did come from. Now, hoping to get out next week. If I do, it's going to be Friday. I don't think I'll be going out next Saturday. I've got um, some big housework jobs to do on a Sunday, so I don't think I'll be up to it. But I will be back on the following week, if not. Have a good one, guys. Go after yourself. Bye-bye.